Hello again people, right we're looking at a different chart today, we're looking at a trading view chart so um, apologies if I uh, faff around with uh, various indicators, uh, not indicators, various ways charting tools because this is relatively new to me. Anyway, what we're looking at is a Morrison's supermarket, uh, UK supermarket chain chart and I thought I'd bring it to your attention uh, for a number of reasons. Really, um, it's an interesting stock in terms of it's come up on a um, on a uh, f screener that I've started testing, trying um, to be at a uh, good value point and a buy, buy, buy on uh, three or four different time frames. And when I've looked at it, opened it up, I can see on the monthly, the one month time frame, we have actually made an engulfing three candle reversal off of what we can clearly see is quite a serious level of um, demand. And uh, we can clearly see we're starting to uh, potentially reverse against this downtrend here. Ton of uh, work to do, as it were, but we have done the engulfing three candle reversal we have done a month's worth of um, uh, pullback and we are making an uptrend low high high low high high on this monthly chart we've broken the previous month's high we have not had a three candle monthly three candle reversal all the way down you know and it, I'm testing stocks and if you're uh, on my Twitter feed you'll be seeing all these stocks going up uh, and various chart patterns being drawn on them. It is the way I learn and while I do it I would normally document it in um, charts and save them to a desktop I might as well document it and put them on Twitter and then we can all learn from it hopefully. So you know we could draw an ascending trend line here three candle reversal up here and down price goes uh, three candle reversal there on this monthly and down price goes these moves are massive because this is a monthly chart obviously um, that's uh, all I can say about this monthly chart the only thing that I'm not happy about on here actually is when we get a three candle reversal we really want to be strongly on the three candle reversal um, bar as it were uh, in the green uh, and preferably above zero situations like we have here uh, three candle reversal there perfect um, trigger on the RSI histo and uh, a powerful move up three candle reversal with this one here same thing it's because it's part of an uptrend so we are picking bottoms breaking the um, the rule of trading really but um, the only thing that I can say about this particular uh, reversal engulfing reversal was that it was a powerful move from downwards uh, momentum to um, the tiny green bar which we do talk about as a vol bomb thank you Simon if you happen to watch this once again we can see that's happened here apologies um, my mouse just disappeared for a moment there vol bomb massive momentum down massive change of momentum to green and massive move uh, I'm not sure whether that's a three candle reversal or what's going on down there either um, no it wasn't the vol bomb wasn't but we can see and this is something worth watching uh, that I don't mention enough because I don't want to complicate things but those that are progressing with what I do we can clearly see a battleground has been broken by a candle here this is another style of three candle reversal really and what that will be on the lower time frames is a good break of some sort of resistance and um, you know what I'm talking about and uh, then uh, you know have its own three candle reversal in there but um, but that's an interesting thing there look all of this area of uh, battleground flip zone I call it price pivot zone where the wicks turn into closes and opens is what uh, this broke through and then boom up it went so another interesting thing to look at you could draw a level on there and this one looks like it's broken through closed through those two 
uh, that flip area and boom up it goes so something I don't mention often enough but I don't want to complicate things too much so yeah I mean on this uh, monthly chart we are definitely looking uh, potential to go, uh, to uh, start to move to the upside monthlies obviously take ages and ages to move so you need to analyze the lower charts lower time frames and see what's going on but uh, uh, let's draw a descending trend line on there while we're on there. I haven't even looked at the weekly chart on this one. Well, perhaps I should have before I started the video, but um, there we have our nice descending trend line. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, attaching lower highs that make lower lows. Simple as that. There is one here as well. We can draw in this chart a low that has uh, made a new higher high. Sorry, I said I was a bit um, iffy with the um, there <coughs> with the charting tools. So um, yeah, back to candles, and let's have a look at the weekly quickly. I won't uh, dwell on this uh, weekly chart, but um, you know the monthly was the important one in my opinion and what have we got going on here well this is just that monthly candlestick uh, arrangement now in swings low high high low high high uh, and um, <coughs> excuse me got tickly cough um, we can tidy that up a little bit now what is this showing us? Well, this week, this Friday, this is going to um, potentially three candle reverse up there. Draw that line on. Uh, that green one there, yeah, that's the ultimate, penultimate low. Ultimate low. Naughty bar there, we need to join those two together. In fact, it'd be wise to join all three of those together. Um, because uh, if you if you trade the break of any one of those lower ones you're trading straight into the higher one so we've tested this also so this is going to be a problem as well this little inside bar high there but um, as you can clearly see we are the monthly leads the way weekly um, break possible playing around again and then uh, potentially a continuation to test these uh, potential sellers over here so uh, we could draw that on as a um, rectangle and um, apologies I said I was rusty with these uh, charts so charting tools but um, there's plenty of room up to there so nice uh, clean red set of candles there really that um, that box should be around here because this is where the flip zone is but you could see that by using the monthly chart actually do it a lot uh, cleaner looking for monthly closes and opens so um, there we go guys so uh, the possible start of a potentially strong uptrend just because we've had a very rare occurrence of a three candle reversal on the monthly chart obviously we've got our normal uh, one two three higher low pattern here as well so it goes on and bearing in mind we enter these trades using a one minute chart messing around on the daily the week the four hour and so on and so forth to fine-tune our entries works on everything stocks indexes and and uh, currencies thanks for watching have a great Friday great weekend too Crypto trading is on its way. Weekend crypto trading, that is.